Hello and welcome to Stories with Symbols. My name is Evie. We've got a special story. It's Goldilocks and the Three Bears. So we're going to one, read the story. Two, learn some words. And three, play a game. Now, let's read the story. Once upon a time, there were three bears. A big popper bear. A middle-sized mama bear and a sweet little baby bear. They lived in a small, neat cottage deep in the forest. Papa Bear had made porridge for breakfast. But it was still too hot to eat. Let's go for a walk in the woods while it cools down, Mama Bear said. So off they went. A little girl named Goldilocks came wandering by. As she passed the bear's cottage, she smelled something delicious wafting out the open window. She peered into the cottage. And seeing that there was no one home, she opened the door and went inside. Goldilocks found three steaming bowls of porridge on the table. So she sat down and helped herself. The big one was too hot. The middle one was too cold. But the little one was just right. After gobbling up the littlest bowl of porridge, she went to find somewhere comfortable to sit. In the next room, there were three chairs. One, two, three. So she leaped from one to the other to try them all out. The big one was too hard. The middle one was too soft. But the little one was just right. Until it broke to pieces. <sighs> I feel a little sleepy. Goldilocks yawned. So she went into the bedroom and bounced on each one of the beds. <laughs> the big one was too lumpy. 
the middle one was too scratchy. But the little one was just right. So she pulled up the covers and went straight to sleep. <sighs> Just then, the three bears arrived home. They were upset to find that someone had been in their cottage. Someone's been eating my porridge, said Papa Bear. And someone's been eating my porridge, said Mama Bear. And someone's been eating my porridge, wailed the little baby bear. And they've eaten it all up. <gasps> then they noticed the chairs. Uh oh Someone's been sitting in my chair, said Papa Bear. Someone's been sitting in my chair, said Mama Bear. And someone's been sitting in my chair, wet little baby bear. And they've broken it. Looking into the bedroom, they were even more upset. Someone's been lying on my bed, said Papa Bear. And someone's been lying on my bed, said Mama Bear. <gasps> Look. And someone's been lying on my bed, cried the little baby bear. All the noise woke Goldilocks, who sprang out of bed and jumped right out of the window. Goldilocks fled into the forest. The three bears never, ever saw her again. Finished. I love that story. Well then, reading the story is finished. Now, let's learn some words. Bear. 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 The bear is walking in the forest. The bear is splashing in the river. Hot Hot The porridge is hot. Look! Steam! 
hot. The fire is hot. A hot drink. Hot weather. Cold. The ice cream is cold. The snow is cold. Cold weather. Learning words is finished. Now, shall we play a game? Today's game is... Let's look for a word in the book. Are you ready? OK, it's an animal. It starts with a B. It rhymes with hair. Have you got it? Yes! It's a bear. A big furry bear. Ready for another one? Let's look for a word in the book. It's a piece of furniture. You sit on it. Sometimes it's made of wood. It starts with the sound ch. That's right. It's a chair. Oh dear, the chair is broken. Right, last one. Hmm. Let's look for a word in the book. It's a food you eat for breakfast. It starts with the sound P. It's made from milk and oats. Have you got it? Yes, it's porridge. Good job. Our game has finished, which now means it's time to say goodbye. Thank you for watching Stories with Symbols.